Hi, this is Joe from eattheplanet.org. Today I'm going to show you how to identify white pine. Um, pine in general is easy to identify from the other needled evergreens such as spruce and fir. I'll show you the primary identification feature for pines in general first. So, uh, this here is a few trees uh, mixed together, one of which is a white pine. Uh, first of all, pine uh, trees, pine needles are grouped um, in these little groupings called, uh, well, these little brown coverings at the bottom are called fascicles or sheaths, and they they group the needles into specific numbers. So white pines, I'll pull off a uh, grouping here. Uh, white pines are a five needled pine, although a couple of needles fell off of this group. There we go. So you can see the five needles there in a single grouping. Uh, spruce and fir are individually growing off the stem. Pines are always grouped. So other pines such as red pine and Austrian pine that have two needles per grouping. So that's the primary identification feature. And that's um, also the length of the needle is going to tell you what type of pine it is. So white pines have approximately three and a half inches. Uh, the needles are approximately three and a half inch length. And that's a good identification feature for white pines. White pines can get gigantic. I've seen white pines that are around 100 feet tall and they grow very quick. So that, that could be another identification feature. Uh, I'll, I'll show you the bark here. It's white pine bark. It, it usually uh, changes from the lower bark uh, it gets smoother as you move up the tree um, until you get to the branches which are very smooth. Uh, these are the branches here. So um, the bark looks different depending on the age of the tree so it's not always a good identification feature um, but it can be used um, to, get, to give an idea if you're looking at a white pine and then you can confirm by looking at the needles. Thanks for watching.